guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Kiki and welcome back to another video today's video I'm going to show you my iPhone 7 plus and what's on my iPhone but before we continue on if you want to see more of me do so well to subscribe and if you do subscribe don't forget to hit the post notification icon for all notifications to get notified of all my videos anytime I upload them and don't forget to give this video a like so without further ado let's get right into the video if you tap here you know it goes like that you know and a lot of things goes up here that is my lock screen so this is my iPhone 7 plus that is a cover I love I'm going to show you the screen here somewhere so on my home screen the very first thing you see on my home screen is my widgets I have a Pinterest widget the medium size here where I've selected some certain pins that shows every hour and then and I also have um, widgets made which is an app for um, creating widgets on your phone so I just customize these writings ask for what you want and be prepared to get it and I have a hashtag expect widget here that um, shows trending so that I get I always you know stay on top of things yeah blah, blah, blah. and the second home page you would see is um, a pixar widget which is you know those yeah because I use Pixar a lot in my thumbnails and editing photos so yeah I use that a lot it gives you some replay people um, some editings people have already done so you can just tap on it you can just tap on it and it gives you a replay okay so yeah and after Pixar I have my folders which contains other apps this is my socials and in my socials I have telegram whatsapp hashtag expect yeah this is the hashtag expect I was talking about so you just um, go to maybe um, TikTok, um, Facebook IG story IG post wherever you want to um, add your hashtags to you just click on it and you just um, Put in a keyword maybe let's use father's day father okay father and then you generate and it generates a whole lot of hashtags trending with that keyword on ig post and then you get it um so yeah father hashtag father kids there are lots of hashtags here you can choose it's really helpful sometimes so can go ahead and use it if you want and then I have TikTok I have um, Instagram messenger snapchat Facebook Pinterest yes that's what I have here and in my Pinterest uh, Pinterest is really good for creativity Wow <laughs> there are a lot of creative stuff here if you want to really bring out your creativity or if you want to anything you want to do that has something to do with you know and then you can go with it or you can pin 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 <laughs> so yeah let's go to my photography so photography i have my camera i have my photos i have a beat sleep video leap lens body lens body it's used for taking um if you want to take your own pictures and there are nobody to help you take them pretty much it's when I don't have anyone around to take my photos for me I use that so yeah and the next I'm gonna show you guys is my entertainment I have Apple music I have episode I have Netflix YouTube and Wattpad audio Mac and Zenda so this is what is on my entertainment folder and my productivity so I have my journal my oh my journal so I have a student's journal here and I have my social media growth and my YouTube content planner here I'm so excited for it though and I have my podcast 
which I listen to it sometimes when I'm on my way to class. Sometimes I listen to comedy, sometimes I listen to um, a lot of educative stuff. Yes. So that is my podcast. I have Audible too. I downloaded this recently, but boom. It's it's a paid thing. I, I didn't think I thought it was maybe free or something. I didn't think you have to pay for it. So I'm just going to stick with podcasts. I don't have an account and my broker has, doesn't have the money too. So yeah, I have Stoic. Stoic is an app that keeps you productive during um, or the beginning of the day. It asks you how you are feeling. And by the way, how are you feeling today? Hope you're good. So it asks you how you're feeling. It's, you're feeling really good today. So yeah, be good. So how did you sleep? It asks you how you slept and all that. And after that, you if you want to journal something, and if you want to meditate, and if you or if you want to focus on your breathing or anything, anything that keeps you um, that sets you up for the day. I've done this a couple of times. So yeah, I have a journey. And so yeah, it's an app that keeps you focused. If you want to focus on something, gives you breaks. So you start, and then it gives you. Sorry, it gives you a short break of five minutes, and then a long break, fifteen minutes, and then it goes again, just like that. Yeah, if you want to focus on something, that is what you do to focus. So yeah. So my next photo we are going to move on to is my creativity folder. In that we have pixel cut. Pixel cut helps you if you want to, you know, cut off any particular thing in a picture. Like maybe if you're selling something and you want to just, just like you've done here, like cut off the shoe, cut off the dress. Yeah, if you want to create um, a background, trying to create any design, it's good for that. And I have my cup cut. This is basically um, what I use to edit my YouTube videos. This is where my creativity sets in. I edit my all my videos, YouTube, whatever. And so yeah. And I have Canva. Canva is where um, if I need to really design something really fast and on the go, I come here. Because they have templates and I use some to make my YouTube thumbnails but mostly I use pixel acts for my um, sorry pixels for my thumbnails but if I really if I really need to just go ahead and do some flyers or Instagram posts or social media anything because they have some templates that I can use and sometimes I just start all afresh from the beginning and do my thing so yeah, Canva is really good if you really need to have something, if you really need to design something on the go, the place you should go is Canva. And I have um, Redbubble and Alibaba and this is my pics app. Yes, I already show you guys, so yeah. I have my mail, mailboxes, yes. And I have my voice memo. You know, there are some things and stuff you just don't have paper and pen to write it down so I have this on the go so if there's some idea comes in my mind I just click it and I just record and put it there as you know my memos so that I can go back to it whenever I want to so yeah I haven't pretty much have this is not and this is actually in the iPhone it was built in it came with it so I didn't have to you know download any app for memos anymore and in my education folder I have notes where I basically jot down anything that needs to be jotted down and some of the advantages that comes with using notes um, iPhone notes is that you can just scan documents without having to download a scanner app is so great because of this i don't have any scanner up on my phone if i need to scan anything i just use my notes to scan and it's so helpful and so interesting so it's so great it's so great iphone really 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 went all in with their apps and i have mim oh god and i have memo or, you know learn coding because i study coding in my program 
so this is just a side playground thing that I used to play with the things I learned in class so yeah Mimo is totally great for that if you want to learn coding I have calculator and translator I have a compass and measure and a clock measure you know almost like the ruler so so that is it for this place and I have yeah we just made sorry I didn't say that we just made to this is what I used to make this I have like a reminder widget so I have no events tomorrow I have no events today or tomorrow and some call it chaos we call it family you know those kind of sayings and I have self-care my self-care app in my space I use my self care it's really interesting hashtag self care this is our space to make magic so yes just interesting maybe I'll do a video and show you how you can make some magic and I have tiny decisions and in here if I'm really feeling confused about something and I want to you know really don't know what to choose i just come here and you can the interesting part here is that you can add your own so let's say should i pause this video create let's create a new question should i upload this video on youtube and my option is yes and I can add another option no and then yeah so oh, so there it is should I so should I upload this video on YouTube then we spin the wheel and see what we get And maybe if you're not so sure about something and it says yes and you are not okay with it it means you want it to be no so you choose it contrary so yeah it really helps a lot the next app that I have here is plan nanny this is an app that helps you get hydrated it guides you to drink water uh, it guides you to drink water it gives you a reminder and it's like a plant you have to anytime you drink the water anytime you drink water you press here and then it fills it it helps grow the plant so if you don't drink your water the plant dies so it's like oh my god i popped that up so it's like pretty helpful yes it's like pretty helpful to get hydrated and because since you're watering the plants and you need the plant to grow you do not want to miss any of the words because your plants will die and that is not cool you know and I have my YouTube studio where I manage all my videos so yeah my YouTube studio I manage all my videos here so yep 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 yeah and settings yeah everything I need to be here yes and this place is the app library there are some things that I don't have on my home screen because I want to keep it as minimal as possible so if something is not here and I want to I just come here and then I type in and I get the app and then I'm good to go yes so that is it I think yeah so yeah and I have my messenger here I have my messenger here my phone my Safari and Apple store so I think God uh, that is it for today so yeah I think I'm done that's basically what's on my phone my iPhone 7 plus and oh this is an iOS 14.6 so yeah I have these you know this is um this is also Pixact. yes and this is a stack widget so it has a lot of yeah and these yes so yeah, 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 yeah. This is it. This is it. This is it.